Hello, good morning, good afternoon, or indeed good evening, depending on when you are watching. I'm James Innes, the Jobs Guru, and next in the interview question series, I'll be taking a look at the question, I think you're overqualified for this job, don't you? Karaiki. So as well as heading up James in this dot group, I'm also the UK's best-selling careers author. And amongst my titles is the interview question and answer book. This is of course available in all good bookshops. So if you'd like a signed copy from yours truly, then there's a link in the description of this video. Now in this show at the moment, I'm taking questions from that book and looking at how to answer them. And at the moment, I'm taking those questions from the chapter entitled, the top 25 tough questions taking the heat. Today's question, I think you're overqualified for this job, don't you? Similar questions include, what would you say if I told you I thought you were overqualified for this job? But back to the question in hand. I think you're overqualified for this job, don't you? Now, in asking this question, the interviewer has most likely already concluded that you are technically overqualified for the job. So by asking this question, they're giving you a chance to comment on the matter, to explain to them why it is that you want this job when it is seemingly perhaps beneath you. Being overqualified for a position is a significant hurdle, as employing such an individual can, unless you can justify yourself, pose a major risk to the interviewer. Are you desperate and prepared to take any job going, whether or not you are really interested in it? There's a lot of that going on at the moment. Are you going to be disappointed with the role and move on quickly when things improve? Are you going to cause problems in the hierarchy? So how to answer, if you are overqualified for the position, then you're going to need to address the issue. There are a number of reasons why you would be considering a job for which you are theoretically overqualified, not least a challenging economic climate with high unemployment and a scarcity of jobs. Regardless of what your actual reasons are, you need to deliver a very convincing explanation to the interviewer if your application is going to survive this question. Naturally, if you don't feel you're overqualified, then do query this with the interviewer. They, if they can tell you why they think you're overqualified, then it will help you to counter their objections. But perhaps you have simply misunderstood what the role entails, and this vacancy isn't appropriate for you. That's a, another possibility. Now, have you ever found yourself interviewing for a job you're overqualified for? How did the interviewer address the matter, and what was your response? Post about your experience in the comment section below, please. Now, as usual, I have plucked a little example from my book for you. I realised that my last position was a management role, and I certainly found this experience invaluable. However, I have concluded that what I really want to do is work directly with clients, finding solutions to their needs, and subsequently delivering and implementing those solutions. I don't see this as taking a step down the ladder. It's purely a question of my seeking out a role to which I am best suited, which I will enjoy, and to which I will consequently be able to give my all. I believe my previous management experience will undoubtedly be very useful in terms of my being better able to understand the bigger picture. However, I am definitely happier and more productive in a customer facing role. Good answer. I mean, I wrote it myself, but it was a decade ago. So, you know, it's been a long time since I read that. But yeah, that is a good example. Now, if you have any interview questions which you think I should be covering, do please let me know in the comment section below. And if I use your question, then I may uh, even give away a free interview coaching session with me, if you like, the man who literally wrote the book on interviews. Or of course, you can just pop along and book a session at jamesinis.group. Thank you for watching today. Keep safe and be well, my friends. Goodbye.